Week 11, Lions, Bears. I've been waiting for this. I know you've been, I don't know, have you been waiting for this? It's been marking my calendar. Really? Yeah. Um, Lions favored by 10. What are your What are your thoughts on that? You love to, you gave us the biggest, you gave me the biggest shit we're saying against the Ravens that we were, what, two-point underdog. So Lions favored by 10. What does that mean? That means you guys are favored. You guys, we are the underdogs and you guys are favored. That's what that means. But like, can you elaborate? On what? Us being favored by 10. Does that mean like we should win by more than 10? No, that means that's what people think is going to be around the spread of like close to that. Is that pretty high for the NFL or I don't, I don't really know. No, that. it's not. It's not? No, it's not. 10, 10 is not high? No. Hmm. Um, you guys had practice yet this week? Obviously not. You know the schedule. But I know you guys it. came in, you guys had a bye week, so I know you got in, you guys came in Monday for some meetings or what was that? I can't disclose that information. What we what, did, what what's we did. The, what's, what's uh, Coach Eberflus talking about? He's talking about winning the next game. It says, we got you guys, Vikings, and then you guys again. So, what do you, What do you say about us? It's a division, divisional game. Not much. It's all about us. It's not. It's not about you guys. They're, they're not the same old lines. Like what, what's no. the talk? What's the we're talk not talking. About? We're not talking about you guys. We're not worried about you guys. It's about us. Like as long as we take care of what we gotta do. But like we'll you know win. how the, the coach will go up and talk about the other team. He didn't talk about you guys. So I'm sure he us. talked. He had to have talked. He, about he something did not. About us. He did not talk about you guys one time. I promise you. It was all about the put, Bears. Put that on your daughter. I put it on my daughter. Really? Yeah. So maybe Wednesday he'll talk about us. Probably. Maybe team meeting. You know. Like keys to we'll victory. See. Yeah, yeah. You know, or office coordinator will go over our shit. We'll see. If, if you're, we're not, we're not, we're not, if, if you're. If you're trying to say that you guys are scary, you guys aren't scary. Like, no, no, not at all. I know we're at, not scary. We're, at, at we're, the the we're the same old lines. You know. At, that. The, at the end of the day, you guys are still lines. Like, yeah, we're the same. Like it, I said, exactly. like, same old lines. No one's scared of you guys. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I, I, I just want to hear. I just want to get a little, you know, yeah, a little yeah, beat no. on your team. Yeah, see yeah, where you guys are at. Yeah, 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 Mentally, guys, physically. You guys um, aren't fucking the fucking Tom quarterback Brady. situation. We don't know yet, right? You don't know. I know. You know though. Of course. Okay, so we keep shit. Uh, we keep shit in house. We don't let right. shit. I can tell by the, your coach getting fired and and all the other stuff. Of course, all in house. In house. Your your uh, your stuff you, getting stolen from from the you, stadium. All that's in house. I know. You know. Do you know what happened? I know what happened. I don't want to you know put it out what on the happened? podcast. You don't. I know you, what don't you, you don't know what happened. I know. Bro, stays in house. I'm yeah, not gonna. What, what do you uh, mean? You told me what happened. To what? <laughs> you told me what happened to your coach. To what? I don't want to put you on blast. On, <laughs> I didn't tell you everyone. shit. Like, I, didn't on, tell, I didn't tell you shit. Now, now you're going to act like this. You tell what happened to your coach. I, 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 I tell tell you what you told me. Like, I didn't tell you no shit. Sense. Now you're just fucking Don't worry. Bluff. I got your back, bro. I got now your you're back. Bluffing. Bro. That's a good bluff. Good bluff. Anyways. Um, but yeah, you guys you guys ready? You think you'll be ready? Of course. Of course. Why would not be ready? Like, What's my record against you? I don't know. Uh, rookie year. One and one. Last year, two and zero. We're here. We should have been two and zero, but we like, so, um, like we already no more. Should have could have would have. Should have could have would have. You're yeah. in the NFL, right? We didn't care about the last game. Three and one. It didn't matter if we won or lost. I'm three and one against you. <laughs> is that crazy or is it like impressive to you? <laughs> it's just fun. it's just fun to say. Oh, it is. We'll see you after this week. Make sure, hey, man. make sure you guys hit in practice. We'll see you after this week. Because we're, we're a physical team. Are you? You think so? And if your coaches, like, don't give your coaches no inside information about me. What inside? What, what is there to say? I don't know. Just whatever you know about me that they might might not know. Like what? I'm confused. What I don't know. I just tell so if, you, if you don't know how much. Like, bro, our, our relationship should be bigger than the team. Okay, if you don't know what I can tell them, how I don't know. But like, if, like what? Well, they've asked me. I don't know. My team has asked me questions about you. Like, really? Like, how was he there? Like, bro, I don't know. Like, they haven't asked me shit. <laughs> they might not be worried. Bro, we should we should be like this. They haven't asked me shit. They okay, haven't asked I'm me just, shit. I'm just letting you know. Yeah. Okay, yeah, of course. They won't ask like, me shit. Like, just because I had a hundred another hundred yard game, like, tell him it's like, the same like, shit. He's not. Like every, he's not that. Game. Tell him this. He's not that good. Like, he runs the I'm, same routes. I don't know what Rouse runs. He so schemes. Like, he gets schemed open. Like he can't win versus man. Just tell him all that. They don't ask me questions about you because, like, okay, good. Perfect. Their job is to know you better than I know you. But the so thing that. is, that's literally impossible. Like you know me better than all of them. 
bro. They watch film on you. I haven't watched film on you. Like, okay, perfect. I just yeah. want to let you know. Okay. Like, don't, don't tell them anything. Be like, I don't know. You, as much as you're talking, you better not lose. <laughs> I you didn't. Say, I never talked about winning or losing. You but. better not lose. I'm just saying. You I wasn't lose. saying anything about winning or losing. I'm just saying you better not lose because come the next. You podcast, guys are a good team. You guys come are a good the ne- team. come next podcast. <laughs> oh my god! I hope you guys you are a really good team. Honestly, just for your mental health, I hope you don't lose. Like it, it, you can. It, like what do they say? Any given Sunday, right? Of course. Exactly. So course. we're not taking no one lightly, especially a division opponent like the Chicago Bears, who most likely will have the quarterback back. And don't smile. But I'm most likely, we'll have, the quarterback, we'll have the quarterback, the QB1 back, um, who's going to have a fire under his ass, ready to play. Uh, so, we'll yeah. see. We'll be, I hope we'll be ready. I hope so, too. What's up, guys? St. Brown Brothers. We're back with another episode. Um, we do have a special guest. I know you guys have been asking, oh, get the Sewer Brothers on. Get get Hutchinson on. You know, we got we got the one and only Jameer Gibbs, Alabama's very own. Actually, I take that back. Georgia Tech's very, very own. Um, I don't count I don't count Alabama. He just went one year. Like, yeah. you really, you're really a Georgia Tech all you do graduate. Is hate. That's all you do is hate. You're really a Georgia Tech hate. graduate. I didn't know this. You're a Georgia That's, Tech kid? Yeah, he's it's a like, transfer. He's a transfer it's guy. It's like Baylor's trying to claim oh Tennessee. Oh, my God. No? Yes. Hey, right. You're see, like, oh, he's one of those. He's one of those. So, but he went to, he finished at Bama. So, I guess he can say, you know, he's a Bama guy. But I asked him all the time, like, bro, who do you root for? He's over here looking at Bama scores. I'm like, you don't look at Georgia Tech scores? I he's do. like, ah. And then he always you reports can't. Georgia Tech players. Right. He always reports his Georgia Tech homies. I'm like, so what yeah. are you? Like, you can't be both. Wait, what? Those are real homies. You always right. report your Georgia Tech boys, but then you always talk about, and you go to Bama games. Like, why don't you go to Georgia Tech game? Oh, my God. Because I have a place exactly. to stay at Bama. I have a place to stay. Where's Where's your place in, at Bama? Uh, family got they pay, they, they pay for they you? Got, they pay for a family spot? Family. It's still it's still leased out? No. Family got Lake House. Bears got a big dub. Well, big dub, I guess you could say, against the Panthers. Um, Prime time. <laughs> Prime time. Uh-huh. Panthers, I, I don't know how I use it. It's you know. NFL, kid. Any given Sunday. It is. I went to win, you know? I lost, lost, lost win. Win. Yeah, exactly. Run me through the game, though. How was it? Um, Our defense played good. Um, their, only, their only touchdown came from a punt return from an ex-bear. Yeah, which, Amir kind of, Smith-Marset. Yeah, kind of, I, was kind, he, kind of Was stung. he talking shit? How did that go? Yeah, before the, uh, after he scored, uh, he was on the sideline. Um, he was sliding. He was saying hi. He like, was. He's, he's, he's a kickoff return. He's a pickup turn the front line. So he's on our sideline. He's like saying hi, hi. Damn. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> so our defense played good. That was the only touchdown. And then you know we played a good game. We played a good game. No turnovers. Um, you know we drove some um, good drives. We need more touchdowns, but you know we got the job qu- done. Yeah, yeah. Question for you is uh, who's is Justin playing this week? I can't disclose that information at this point. At this point, we're enemy. At this point, we're enemies. I can't tell you this. Like at this point, we're not friends. Like I can't just give you information. Okay, you don't have to tell me, but do you know who's playing? I I know the answer. Yeah. Okay. I okay. Yeah, I can't tell you. We'll find out anyways. We we yeah, have people yeah, in yeah. our building that find stuff out like that. Oh really? Yeah, yeah, but we'll you, find out. You got spies and shit. Like, <laughs> how you gonna know? No, no, we're not pulling on Michigan, but we'll we'll find out. Okay, you guys are in Michigan, so I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> um, so you guys won a close game, nail biter. I was you know on the plane, so I kind of watched some highlights on YouTube, but uh, run through again. I'll go first. Um. Well, back back at the crib, you know, had a, you didn't go. You should have came to the game. I don't know why you didn't. I had a flight, and it was only you could, red eyes. Bro, you could have taken this. What time do we play? One, two, three. You could have uh, taken like a six o'clock. There was no six. It was only it was only like one p.m., twelve p.m., and then the rest of them were nine p.m. Hmm. Or red eyes. Well, yeah, nah. Uh, game was good. Um, you know, I had to did my thing back at home. A um, little slight, little eight for nine. One whatever, what was it? One fifty six, one touchdown. Mm-hmm. Some slight. Uh, yeah. I feel like I could have had more, but you know it is what it is. Look, listen, not there on table type. Shit. What I really want to talk about is Jameer. Um, I mm. r- run me through that that run you had, the cutback, <laughs> everything. What was it? What was the play? Uh, do it. Wait, 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 I say the play. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, yeah, no, give us a play. Give us a play. Give us a play. Like, what it, was was just a, it was just a toss. Was just, yeah, I seen yeah. it. Just a toss. Give us a play. Right? Give us a toss play. to the right. Toss yeah. to the right. Yeah, it's Jameer, it's a safe space. It's a safe space. <laughs> I got a little toss. 
Um, reading the defense, I saw Panay. He got he had Joey kicked out Bosa. Graham Graham kicked out his man. Saw a crease hit it. See a little cutback lane. Who's on the backside? Is that Asante Samuel. There two hawked you? No, he didn't hawk me. So so I was running sideways. I looked behind Asante. Bro, I just ran straight to the end zone. So it was like I'm running sideways. He's running to the end zone. But like, I mean, I can't believe you didn't score. Your oh, foot barely he, went out of bounds. He barely. He did hawk you. I thought you were fast. My brother said you were fast. I don't know. Like, you were that <laughs> don't fast talk about don't talk about speed. He gets he gets emotional about speed. Like, how'd you get hawked by low, a low? Like, like he, I, he was already in front of me. How was I getting hawked, bro? I'm looking at the clip. That's that's getting hot. Is Aloy fast? You play with enemy. Is he fast? I mean, he's not. He's fast. He's not slow. But like, as fast as you talked about how fast Jameer was. I'm like, running sideways. Like, what do you? I'm running. I'm running sideways. Bro, you're a running back, bro. You should be able to run sideways full speed. That didn't make any sense. Like, that's not. <laughs> that does. That, that, that didn't good. make any sense. It does. It does. Oh my god! I hot too. But, but you got the. You ended up scoring though. They let they let you in. How'd that yeah. go? Honestly, I don't even know. Did they? Because usually David comes in. Yeah. So David, so David ran out because I was supposed to come out. Then David came out. He came and got me. And then we was then he then he was like, uh, he was like, John, you want it? I was thinking. I was like, uh, yeah, yeah, let me get it. So he was like, bet. And he just ran out, and then he let me get it. So props to uh, Big Bro, Demo. Good guy. Yeah. Good guy. Yeah. Great, great, great guy. He had a, he had a crazy run. See, he had a run. He didn't get hawked. That's what that, like he didn't get hawked. <laughs> he did. I mean, we were blocking downfield though. That's a fine R. You get, you get tackled in the fucking in, in the five. At the one? Five. No, you get tackled at the one. That's a fine. For us, you get tackled at the five. Inside the five, five hundred dollar fine. Get hawk. Who? Anyone or just wide outs? Wide outs. Well, that's crazy. It is crazy. Yeah. Inside the five. Yeah, because if you get if you get tackled inside the five, like you might as well get touched under the fucking running back. Wait, wait. So what do y'all consider hawk though? Like, what what happened to you? How? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's that's what we call hawks. But he was in front. If of that me. happened to me, I'd be called slow, your hawk, all that shit. Like, but he was in front of you though. Like he was like, it was an angle. He's it was an angle, and he hawked you. Nah, that wasn't a hawk. Yeah, nah, it wasn't a hawk. hawk. I'm here to vouch for him. That wasn't a hawk. Okay, okay. But I did think you would score that. I did. So I don't know. I mean, just a little. I mean, it's not like. like well, it I looks like you're. Wait, wait, let me ask you this: Did you think you were gonna score as you broke? Um. Like you know, you're running like damn. He's there. Like I'm not getting this. Yeah, cause I, 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 think I, get I was this. thinking I was like, because you know I had the ball in my right hand. So when I cut yeah, back, I seen that too. So I'm like, so, so I was like, should I switch it? Because Asante was right there. And I, I didn't know how fast Asante was, so I was like, nah, I ain't gonna switch it. So I just kept yeah. running, and then I seen 32, and then like I I didn't know what to do, so I just like ran into him right. a little bit, you know, try to put some weight, put like some weight into him, to, like can you know get him leaning. If you would have kept your foot in, you would you would have scored. Yeah, my foot like slipped. Yeah. I felt like quick, but. I thought I still got in, but nah. If you were a little faster, you would score too. Type shit. But type shit yeah. What do I know? <laughs> oh, but, yeah. You, you would have scored? Yeah, for sure. I would have big body. I was stiff armed. Easy. You, your ball would have been a left hand? <laughs> yes. That's the first thing I do. Outside arm every time. You, you're running back. <laughs> you should know that. <laughs> like, body ball boundary. Arm, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, outside arm. Body ball like, boundary. Like, what, like, what? Bees. like, you should learn that. You should have been there from Alabama. I hope they taught you that there. No, he didn't. He didn't push the ball. Did, Coach G didn't did you see what he did in the end zone? What was that? Yeah, hey, what, yeah what was yeah, your celebration? I, I saw some kid do it uh, on TikTok. It was like some 7 on 7. Like, he does 7 on 7. That, that shit was hard. Can you stand up and do it again real quick? No, that's okay. No, I ain't got it. Put the clip up. I, I want to see the clips. I want to see the clips. <laughs> Of, of that of that dance, you see me in the back, like I, as he was doing, I was running to him. Doing I, I saw. Him. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's your next? What's your next touchdown celebration? Who do we play? Oh damn, the Bears. Fuck. Uh, the Bears. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I mean, you'll probably score like three, four times, so you have a lot of options. But I gotta keep a couple in the back pocket. Yeah, you definitely more than one this week. Please, four, four more than four. one. Four pocket four. More than one. Do you have one? Here? What's your next one? Me? I yeah. can't tell you. You know, I always got something ready. Okay. Listen, if I was going to score again in LA, I was going to crip walk. Oh, you should have done that first. But you wanted, I you know. wanted to slide the yeah. longest, though. Yeah. I want, I've been wanting to slide for like three weeks. Yeah, yeah. You dropped the bag. I, what do you think my – what do you give my slide to me? It was good. But I thought – I mean, it wasn't like – It should have been longer, huh? It should have been longer, huh? It wasn't as good as the kids on TikTok, but like I thought that it was impressive for doing on turf, but – now I know that turf and cleats have nothing to do with it. So, like, they kind of took it back down. But, like, I thought because you were in cleats on turf 
is harder to do, but if it's just as easy, like you could practice more. Like I could tell you didn't really practice. If I would win like five more, five more rotations, JMO mm-hmm. was in my way. Did you see that? Yeah. Like who was I, that? I couldn't, I couldn't go no more. <laughs> I, I was trying. Like, even if I wanted to. I sprinted off the sideline. I was going to get out the fishing pole and roll you in. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I got I scored. I had the ball in my hand the whole time. Then I was running to the sideline. I threw that. I threw it all the way to the sideline. And I came off the sideline. I was hype. And then Dan comes up to me. He's like, hey, the ref came up to me. He said, you know, that's a, that's a penalty next time. Make sure you're off the field before you throw it. I'm like, oh, my bad, my bad. But you love Bro, I didn't know that's a penalty. The ball. What's the penalty? What's the penalty? What's the penalty? What's the penalty? I just chucked that bitch. Uh, After a touchdown? Yeah, so I did a touchdown. I had the ball in my hand the whole time when I was doing the dance. And I uh, tapped everyone it's up. Not, it's not then funny, I was bro. walking towards the sideline. I just chucked it at our sideline. Bro, where's the Raiders? Like, he got a first down. And he <laughs> got me just through the ball. And I was like, is that a penalty? I was like, bro, <laughs> I didn't know what. Like, you threw it like, like, bro, it was he like threw it far? It. Like, he just threw it as hard as he could, just threw the ball on the first down. <laughs> just threw it straight. He's, he's a youngest sibling. He loses control sometimes. I can't help it. Tell him, Jimmy, you tried to catch me on that one until I was scooting. He was, he was sliding a little bit. I was like, damn, you're yeah. running. He's trying to block down for his, like, you're not, if you're behind me, it's like, there's no blocking down field for me. No, it really, it really isn't. Because, like, you was on the sideline, so it's like, you was already going to go. Oh, let him act like, like he's fast. Bro. Like, you was the, you had me, no if, intentions. If you're behind me, look, if you're behind me, how are you going to block for me? It's over. But you bro. had no intentions of coming you're, you're in. Saying, like, you're, saying, you're, saying, like, you're saying no one's faster than you. Right, like, it's, it's going to be hard for you to catch up and get a downfield block. No, it was not. I kind of. No, it's like, pretty I easy. I feel like there's a few guys on your team that can catch up to you. I caught up very fast, but you just went out down. Wait, I see you trying to catch up to Demo. Like, you can catch up to him? I did. I, you know when you're like, you know you when you're like, no, listen, this is what happened. I blocked Derwin. He cut back. I'm like, oh, damn. All right, he's about to get tackled in like 20 yards. So I like jogged. Wait, wait, and wait, he wait, kept wait, going. Wait, 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 wait. Why are you jogging? Why are you, Why are you, you loafing? Why'd you say that? No, because they had two dudes running. And then J-Mo, I, I didn't know J-Mo was going to get that block. So I was like, oh, he's probably going to get tackled in like 20, 30 yards. So I was jogging. And then I see J-Mo's block. And I, you see me catch up. If it was like no, 20 more yards, I'd get on no, I was catching no. up. Bro. I was looking. I was like, I, prom- I even put it. I put in my note in my head. I'm like, I gotta catch up. Like, let me go fast. <laughs> nah, bro. Um. Let's so go we got some some get to know you questions, Jameer. All right. Um. What's the the first Super Bowl that you remember? Uh, probably the Ravens and 49ers. I think. Wait, how old are you? 21. Damn. Where are you from? Georgia. No. Georgia. Mm-hmm. You grew uh, up, who was your favorite team growing up? I mean, I was from Georgia. That's why. I like. What? Because like, I didn't. Because I didn't really watch a lot of NFL. But I, like when I went, when I did watch it, I'd go for Atlanta because like you know I'm from Georgia, so I was like going that. That's why I said you're not from Atlanta. I'm from, from Georgia. Dalton. Man. Relax, relax. Like, it's from Dalton, Georgia, not Atlanta. Like how, how far is Dalton from Atlanta? Mm. He's not, you're not. You're from. Te- why do people say you you're said, from Tennessee? You said though? that. <laughs> you said that. No, cr- Tennessee's a hater. Uh, Craig uh, said you're from Tennessee. Yeah, I might. Are you, are, are you close minutes. to Tennessee? Mm. Damn, oh. you're a Tennessee baby. Anyways, that's well, crazy. Uh, you're not even. You're not a real case. Georgia baby. <laughs> Um, what's your favorite non-home stadium to play in? I don't know if you've played in that many yet, but... Just, just in it, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, That's bro, you've played like, in, like, three. I mean, I, uh, what, what has been your favorite stadium to play in so far? Probably Kansas City or Lambeau. Um, Kansas City, yeah. First game, because yeah. first game, it was, it was like, all eyes was on us. Mm-hmm. It was like, it was lit. Mm-hmm. That's rare for you guys. Go ahead. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> whoa. Do, you hear, do, you, do you hear the slander? Oh, that's crazy. It's all good. We have all week to prepare. Um, who's your favorite musical what? artist? Who? Actually, you know what? Let me guess. Who's the future? Um, no. Uh, bro, it just listens to everything. He's top, Little baby. top, top three. My favorite, my favorite, favorite like used to be the, Young Boy, movie. but like he stopped, he stopped with the music for like a little bit. So like I've been listening to a lot of like different people. So uh-huh. like I just play everything answer? now. Like you, think, so, you know, I play everything. Like, this one, yeah, yeah. But if you had to choose one, but right now, like, who you listen like, to most? Yeah, who you listen to most? And what's the name? 
You know, do uh, do the um sings uh get back. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I would listen to him. Like. The get back a mob, like that one. So it's like YBN, uh, YBN fat. I don't even know who that. That's is. where I got that cash for fun. You're 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 confused. You're confused. Get your shit together. Um, <laughs> <laughs> when's <laughs> when's the hardest? Go ahead. When's the hardest you ever been hit? Uh. Oh yeah, I want to hear this. Damn, probably uh a practice. Remember, remember uh, <laughs> Saint, TJ. Yeah. Yeah. That's the hardest you've ever been hit. Hey, can you tell us like what happened? We ran, we ran uh we ran like a little rollout. We ran a rollout. And then, like a, like a drag I think Jared was looking downfield and yeah. then he retired for a check down. I guess he didn't see CJ. I hope he didn't see CJ. <laughs> then you know see CJ just came and smacked me like but whole body was in the air, legs in the air. <laughs> If he was a rookie, <laughs> was a rookie. Was like, next game. Like, fans was there. Yeah, Everybody was like, "Ooh, welcome!" Like, oh my god, like, he was talking shit, and yeah, CJ was he hyped. Was like, like, I was like, yeah. 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 "You know who he's talking." With holiday season right around the corner, it's time to uh, bust out your best jeans, t-shirt combination. And you know where I'm gonna go? I'm gonna go to True Classic to uh, you know look my best, and I want you to look your best too. So make sure you get some True Classic t-shirts. And, you know, impress whoever you want. May that be a girlfriend or you might be single and try to, you know, have a girlfriend for the holiday season. You know, it's cuffing season. So make sure you wear True Classics um, T-shirts. It's comfortable. It looks good. It's affordable. And um, make sure you look your best to impress people that mean the most to you. Man, this is a perfect gift for you, but also a gift for her. So if you're ready to upgrade your closet, shop now with my exclusive link at trueclassictees.com slash brown bros and save up to 60% off site-wide during the November holiday sale. End the year with a holiday cheer. Thanks to True Classic. Personally, for me, when it comes to sweatshirts, hoodies, or crew necks, or even t-shirts, um, I like to go with uh, True Classic tees. Um, they're always reliable. Um, they can go for it. They can match me for any situation I need to go in, whether it's formal, casual. Um, they look great. They feel great on my skin. Um, and when you wash them, dry them, they come out just like the way you put them in. So it's a, overall, it's a great quality of t-shirt. You can't go wrong with it. I recommend it for everyone, every guy out there, or women. To get yourself true classic tea, um, especially when it's cold outside, you know, you could have warmer shirts than some others, and it's just a great overall. Like you can't go wrong. Like just, just don't argue with me. Just get one. What's the craziest thing you've seen in the weight room, uh, training room, or field? Like the craziest, whether that's weightlifting, uh, a hit out, you know, on the practice field besides you getting hit. Um, like what's the craziest thing? No, one time. One of my strength coaches, my strength coach from GT, like he, he like he would post videos on Twitter, like of him like working out before we got there. So like uh-huh. this dude had like it was pitch black in the stadium, and he sits the phone down like on like I guess like on like the uh, shit that separates the field and the uh, stands. He just puts like on a little wall, on the like little wall, and he puts record. And all you see for like ten seconds is nothing. Then all you see is him just. Flying past the camera, bro. That shit was the most hilarious shit I've ever seen, bro. In the dark? Yes, bro. It's pitch black. And all you see is like, it's all you see. This is legs, bro. <laughs> what was that for? <laughs> it was just motivation. Like he was like, it was like he was talking, and then like all you see, him just scoot across. <laughs> <laughs> what about uh, your quarterback, uh, Jalen Milrow? Oh, in the weight room. In the weight room. Oh my god. So he would, I think. Just hand clean. He would just have like three, three something, just throwing it. Ugh. Ugh. Like, He's strong like that? Bro, strong. Like, What about like, what does he squat? We didn't, we didn't really do squat maxes, so we did more like speed stuff. So, uh, uh-huh. I didn't really see him squat, but I just paid attention to him power clean and hand clean. But it was crazy though. What about like, uh, he didn't bench anything? Like, Bench, no back squat. No, nah, you know, quarterbacks don't like with their arms. They do like their own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So. Wait, is he? What do you think I'm benching right now? Huh? You? Yeah. You're probably benching like one rep max? Two rep max. No, I've never heard of two rep max. What do you mean? Yeah, it's crazy. Like, what do you think I'm benching? What do you think I'm benching? What's a two rep max? <laughs> it's fine. What, what do you I'm... mean? Like, okay, one rep max. What do you think I'm benching right now? You two seventy two ninety five two ninety five. Well, am I right? 
No. I'll send you a video tomorrow. Three oh five? I'll send you a video tomorrow. Three three ten? I'll send you a video tomorrow. Three fifteen? I'll send you a video tomorrow. Can you just tell me on here? And then send three, me a video? Four three fifteen. Everybody wanna know now. Three yeah, three twenty five? I'll send you a video tomorrow. Anyways. Bro, you're uh, not strong. <laughs> anyway. You're not strong. Moving on. <laughs> Uh, Jameer, who's your favorite player growing up? Player? Uh, shit, probably Barry, which is a coincidence. It's like I drafted him. Mm. Is it actually Barry or you're just saying Barry? No, it was Barry. But, okay. but I watched a whole lot of uh, people growing up. I watched LaShawn McCoy, uh, Jamal Charles, Asian Peterson. Mm. But, I mean, before I got in the league, I used to. What about Chris Johnson? AK. Oh yeah, Chris Johnson too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chris Johnson. Bro, watch, did you watch his tape? Like he's fast. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. It looks like he's not even trying when he's running. Yeah, like it's like he only re- he only needs to run as fast like as he needs to. He yeah. never goes faster than he has to. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. His speech is faster than everybody else's. So. Hey, is he faster than you? Me? Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking. <laughs> he thinks he, maybe he thinks he's the fastest in the world. Like, are you faster than the team? team? Same. I'm He's are asking you. Are you? Are you faster? I'm asking you though. What do you? Who no, do you I'm, no, I'm not. I'm not asking him. I'm asking you. <laughs> I say I'm definitely top three. I'm definitely. Who's faster than you? Faster than me? I don't know who's faster than me, but I know I'm, know I'm top three. Are you faster than Jamo? How far are we running? <laughs> sideline to sideline. Oh, so like fifty-two. I don't know. He might get it. He might get it. by a little bit. By a little bit though. You know, he he this dude, he's used to running like all the way. You know. The mm-hmm. Demir would love to come up to you and just ask you about like your forty and how fast you <laughs> ran. Just smile at you like, bro, get out of my face. Like, <laughs> no one cares. But what'd you, you run? What'd you what'd you run? Uh, four four. No, nah, four three six. But what'd you run your pro day that you love to say? Or no, you faster than Velas. You said what? He he he'll be like this. I ran a four three six, but I ran a I yeah, ran a four two yeah, the week, training. The week when we was training, the week before, I ran four two seven. And then that means nothing. Where we ran at the combine, we ran four three six. I'm telling you. He said he That's said kinda, he, was, he said he was hurt. I mean, of course. I was oh yeah, yeah, because my hamstring. Yeah, the whole the whole time when um, when I first got um, down to Florida to train, I think it was like the third day. You know, the treadmills they be running on. Mm-hmm. I got a, um, I could, what was it? I, got, I strained my hamstring or something like that. And then, so I didn't, I didn't, I wasn't really like running for like five weeks. So I was more like doing rehab and like doing like little starts. So like, that was really like my first actual like run, you know, or the first two. Me too. I only ran 140 before my combine. I was hurt. I was only five rest starts. Was you run? Uh, four four eight. Oh, that's faster than Saint. It's crazy. He's faster than you, Saint. Oh, uh, Jameer, what was your favorite? Whoa. What was your first concert? <laughs> <laughs> He's faster than you, Saint. What? 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 We'll see Sunday. We'll, ra- we'll race Sunday. How does that right, sound? After the game, y'all just gonna race? No, no. Before the game. Before the game, we we'll do like a little twenty yard burst. Why right twenty? Let's go. Let's go forty. I don't want, bro. I can't. I want to get hurt before the game. Oh, okay. Is that, can we do that? Like a scramble start, twenty yards. You can do what you want. That works for you, Jameer? Like, yeah, yeah, so yeah. yeah. I'd be done. Okay, okay. I'd be done. Okay. okay. You can join, too. Oh, no, yeah. I'm not no, afraid. I, no, I, I want to raise you. Yeah. Let's do like a little 20-yard race. 20-yard race. Like, this is... Okay, bet. Bet. Yeah. <laughs> okay, bet. Uh, like I said earlier, what was your first concert? I've never been on one. Really? Yeah, I've never mm. been on one. I've always wanted to oh, be We, we, we got to take him on one. Yeah. He, uh, what, what are you staying in the off-season? Like, you're going to stay in Detroit? No, I don't know where I'm going to stay yet. Hmm. Maybe in Georgia? Get, you should probably get on that. Maybe. I don't know. All that money, you just don't know where you're going to stay, huh? I don't. Ask him. No, if, 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 you if you went to them raw and had what do you some millions, like, you would know where you're going to stay, right? I, I already had, would have bought a crib somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> a crib would have been purchased <laughs> somewhere. You, you just go back to Cali? Yeah, yeah, we just go back to California. You can come visit if you want. Okay. You ever just been? Let me know. Like just to 
He was like, yeah, he, he, he was after he got drafted. He was there. Yeah, for the uh, rookie premiere thing. Oh. Yeah, but then like you don't really know what you're doing. Like as a little rookie, like you're like, ah. Like, yeah, yeah, I was just like, uh, yeah, I was, yeah, yeah. Show going through motions. Shit. I was just going through motions. Yeah, it's so lost in the rookies. Like it's crazy. Um, <laughs> who's the best team you ever placed? I mean, who's the best team you ever faced? Could have been huh? could have been college or NFL. Uh, probably not. when I was at GT when we uh. We played that 2021 uh, Georgia team. With the defense? Mm-hmm. That was crazy? Yeah. Wait, I don't like that? Back to this. It was like 50-0. Did you yeah. run the wing tee at Georgia, Georgia Tech? Huh? Did you run the wing tee? No. Whatever? No, I went there with no mm-hmm. spread. But that's, they ran the wing tee at Georgia Tech? Before I got right? there. Like, like two years before I got there. I thought that was like yeah. the Navy. Or was it Navy? Or they did that, that right? too. Yeah, yeah, they did that too. But Georgia Tech does it too. Yeah, I think when Calvin Johnson went there, I think they were running the wing tee. Or maybe not. No, I don't think so. I think it was like after he left and then um, like that little, you know, little mm-hmm. couple years stretch before. Yeah, I that's just there. annoying. Yeah, it's just horrible. Um, who's one player you would like to meet in the open field one on one? Like truck, juke, whatever you can do, but you just meet him one on one, you get through the hole, boom. And he's like ten yards away, meeting you right, you know, in the hole. But not in the hole, he's like ten yards back. Uh Yeah, that's a good one. Uh, probably, I don't know. Because, you know, I don't want to get hit, bro. That's why it would be. You don't like getting hit? Pause. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> that's why I'd be running. Like, like Troy Palomalu, Ed Reed, uh, Ray dude. Lewis. Yeah, I do. No, fuck no. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing Ray Lewis. I Brian do. Dawkins. No, I agree. I, I, Ronnie Lott. I stick with Ed Reed. I just stick with Ed Reed. Hey, I'm not you, be, you better make a miss. Do you run from contact? Do you shy away from contact? No, nah, but I'd rather just not like, get hit. Mm, okay, okay, okay. What do you look like without dreads? Huh? What do you look like without dreads? Do you have a picture? Yeah. No, I don't, I don't got one on my phone. With the holiday season right around the corner, HelloFresh uh, is a great platform for you to get groceries quick and easy to your door. Um, you never have to worry about the kind of products they're using because they're using the best out there. I know it's busy for a lot of people with, you know, work, shopping, you know, for the kids or even, you know, uh, what they saving around the corner. Like you might not have time to go to the grocery store or every store you want to. So HelloFresh is a great, great place for you to go to get your stuff delivered right to your front doorstep. You might be feeling sick or it might be too cold outside, depending on where you live. Too much traffic, you know, for like leaving. You can always use HelloFresh to get the ingredients you need to make a great meal for you and your family. Uh, right at home. Go to HelloFresh.com slash 50 Brown Bros and use the code 50 Brown Bros for 50% off plus 15% off the next two months. That's 50% off plus 15% off the next two months when you use the code 50 Brown Bros at HelloFresh.com slash 50 Brown Bros. America's number one meal kit. Who's the funniest teammate you ever had? <laughs> uh, bro. Uh, some people are probably not even trying, bro. So let's. Who's the funniest on the Lions, you would say? On the Lions? Yeah. I say Jamar. I was going to say Munch. Yeah, I was going to say. Dude, this dude is just hilarious, bro. <laughs> Without even trying, he's looking at him. You'll laugh, bro. I <laughs> swear to God. He's so ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean like that. He's my dog. He's Munch. hilarious, bro. I was so happy when he came back. Oh, my God. Me too, because he was out for like eight weeks with, yeah. a, with a calf. We yeah. signed him back. I'm like, yes. But then he's like, <laughs> we have the regular locker. His locker got took. Like, <laughs> <laughs> he's like next to the equipment. He's like. Right. He's, like, he's in the corner. I'm like, fuck, my nigga crunch. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, he, he would always come to come back to uh, the little corner. He'd be like, hey, bro, can I get my locker back? Like. <laughs> I know, bro. And then he had 28 before he before he left. He got hurt, and then you got know, I guess they got a <laughs> we got like a injury settlement. Yeah. So someone took 28, and he came back in 39. He's like he was in the mirror before practice. He's like, I look so butt. <laughs> <laughs> He's in 39, and then Jamo was like, you look like Steven Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was so funny, bro. Oh, I can just picture it, bro. I just picture him, but Jamo is funny. Mm-hmm. Um, what was college recruitment like for you coming out of high school? 
Cause I know you transferred from from GT. Yeah. But like, what was your recruiting like? Cause you were at the army. You went to the army game, right? Yeah. Oh, so you had offers. Yeah, I had like I think I had like twenty eight. Um, and you decided to go to Georgia Tech. Yeah, cause of my running back coach. It's a short choice. You had twenty eight offers and oh, decided damn. to go to Georgia Tech. Yeah, I just told you why. That is crazy. Your running back coach from high school went there, or what? Nah, he just uh, you know, he's just. He's a great coach. You know, he's down to earth dude. Uh, had a lot of trust in him. I'm saying, who was your coach? So, why, so why'd you so why'd you leave? Our choice. So why'd you leave? Because we suck. It was bad. It was terrible. Hmm. I could have told you that before you committed, but continue. Like what? Like what kind of schools did you have? Uh, LSU. You probably had every school you wanted, right? Yeah. Yeah. You had Bama. Yeah, but it was like I think it was like not committal. Yeah, I know, you know what you mean. They had a lot of bags, too. I think they had, like, Najee, B-Rob. And they had three committed already, like, from my, cl- from my class. And somebody else was there, mm. too. I forgot who. But. You had uh, USC? Yeah. You had Notre Dame? I think so. I think I had Notre Dame. I know you, I had, you, I had you, don't really, you don't really remember Notre Dame, huh? Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember. Yeah, that's not a school, like, <laughs> I would, like you're really worried about. I feel that. <laughs> I don't um, know how and all that, but. What was your favorite moment in your college career? Let me guess. You guys, no, you lost to Tennessee. Yeah. So, yeah. what was your favorite moment in college? Uh, shit. I guess when we just won the little sugar bowl, you know. Damn. <laughs> so, what, damn. what was your worst moment? Tennessee, probably. Yeah, Tennessee. We lost to that. Damn. Bayless loves that. He fucking he, loves that. He lives to that. That's what he lives for, huh? Yeah, he fucking lives for Tennessee. Like, that's like, I'm like, bro, you went there for two years. Like, he bleeds fucking Tennessee. I'm like, bro, you're not even a whoa, like, so annoying. You have any uh, good Nick Saban stories? Like, if you had to choose one, no, I don't Nick have any. Saban story, not one. No, cause I, no, I wasn't, I wasn't. I was only there for a year, and plus, like, I barely saw him, cause like, you know, he's with the defense, so like, we play, we probably saw two different fields, and then like, you don't see him the whole day until like team meeting, and then practice. Like, that's the only time you'll see him for. Real. So you didn't he, he didn't really talk to you like that. No, nah, unless it was like keep yeah. up retiring, he'll like make jokes or whatever. But I don't remember any right. jokes for real. That's crazy. Yeah, could have went to SC right when you were transferring. Yeah, funny, bro. Lincoln Riley, <laughs> <laughs> bro. You know how like coaches like they got your number, so like they'll call or like text you. This man Lincoln Riley DM me on Instagram. Like, oh my! Bro, I didn't even know coaches had Instagram. I didn't either. Yeah. I, didn't know, what? That's crazy. I mean, you know he's not running it. it was, you, you thought it was Lincoln Riley. It was. Yeah, it was you don't want to go there. If he went to SC, thinking about how dangerous they could have been. Yeah, because my running back coach, he was he was going there at first, going from GT. He was going there, and then because he le- so he left like right after I left, like a like couple of days after. Uh-huh. And then so he got a job there, and then like. Two days later, he went. He got a job at Texas. He left and went to Texas. Damn, smart, smart man. And we're trying to get Addison at Bama too, but I don't know what happened. Nah, we 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 stole him. Um, when did you think you had a chance at going? You know, to leak? going pro. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, know. you probably when you got to college, but like, when was it like? Damn, like, I can really do this. Uh, yeah, probably like freshman year college. Like you were crazy freshman year, huh? Yeah, I was. I was. Yeah, until I got hurt. I think like fifth or sixth game, I like pulled my hamstring. I missed the rest of the season. I, like I almost tore it. They said it was like five centimeters away from like tearing completely off the bone. But like my first ever touch was a kickoff return, and then I returned it for like eighty-seven yards or something like that. And then, mm-hmm. I you got, you got and then I had two touches that game, so. You got hot on the kickoff. You got hot. Nah, bro. There, there, was, there was enough blocking downfield, bro. Like, wait, you? How do you return to eighty yards and not score? Yeah, like once you get past, like at that point, you caught. It was not the finish back. Either. It's not like it was just straight. It was like start right. We're, we're, we're gonna have to check you're, the tape. You're not cutting. You're not counting yards going sideways. I know that. So no, no like, man. okay, so someone hopped you. You may got hot, like. Y'all's definition of hot. I, I know the kickoff. I don't know how kickoff works. The fucking guys run down, and as soon as you break, now it's a fucking race. So you got hopped. But it's not That's like I broke and it was just straight. I broke and I had like keep weaving, 
and dude was blocking. Cool. I had to like read his block, and it was just you know. Yeah, blocking. but you're not weaving 87 yards. Like once you get past, yeah, you can't. But if someone say someone's way downfield, then it's no one's way down there though. Yes, it yeah, like if, if he had to cut, if he had to like cut around a kicker, and then someone else coming, then he cuts back. It's over. Yeah, we have to check the tape. I'm at 87 yards. That's 90 yards. You know how far that is? Like you're getting hot. Wait, you said 87. Yes, I think it was an eighty or eighty-seven. It was somewhere around. As a hawk, that's getting hawked. It's like you got to tackle it at like the ten. No, nah. yeah, that's getting hawked. If you tackle at the ten on a kickoff, that's getting hawked. Not really. You guys in the tape. I, I, but I caught the ball at the end zone. Though. Nah, nah, no, nah, it was an eighty because we got the ball at the twenty-something. <sighs> I can't you wait till you get hawked on Sunday. And we're just on the sideline laughing at you, Nimi. It's gonna be crazy. I don't know. It won't happen. He's gonna catch. A, he's gonna catch like a slant and get tackled. Like, who's the who's 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 the fast guy on your defense? I have no, no idea. Defense? I have no idea. Um, I wouldn't know either, probably. You. Anyways, what was your draft probably, process probably like? Probably Jerry Jacobs. Mm. It's like, I don't know what it is. Probably. What was your draft process like? Uh, it was smooth. Uh, I had a lot of. Was at the combine. I had like nineteen officials or informals. Mm-hmm. I think that was called informals. The little, uh, Something meeting. like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, I had nineteen formals, and then in like one uh, in like one day. So that shit was crazy. But I didn't get to eat. I was hella weight, so I came in a bit skinny on the weigh-in day. I went. In, I went in like at like two o four when I went in. And I weighed in like at two hundred or one ninety nine or some shit like that. It was like one ninety nine right nine. And then, what do you weigh right now? Huh? What do you weigh right now? Yeah, probably just, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, my, my skills in the bathroom. Uh, I don't know. I've been trying to get it, you know, up. You guys been waiting every week? We can't we can't disclose uh, inside information, so oh, keep okay, talking okay. to me. Okay, okay. Yeah, but like, it, it was cool, though. I had a lot of uh, teams re- reach out to me. Okay. Um, what was draft day like? Obviously, you went first round, so, like, that was good for you. I know you were excited. Like, yeah, I was just I was just at the crib. I had all my family, or most of my family, close family, and some of my close friends with me, and my girlfriend. She was there too. And then you know that's really about it. Shout out Nicole. Yer. Yeah. How long have you been dating her for? Uh, eight months will be Thursday. Hmm. You love her? Yeah. What? I'm just wondering. Um, what, was, <laughs> what, 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 what was your welcome to the uh, NFL moment? Like, what was the moment where you're like, "Damn, I'm in the NFL"? Like, probably the first, probably the first game when we like we walked out, yeah. and I was just like just looking mm-hmm. around, and like you Shit, see like a huh? plane, you know, at Arrowhead, the plane just was it like, different than college? No, though, huh? Like, no, nah, it wasn't it different. Was no, it wasn't that different. Pretty much the same, but like, you know, co- like a lot of college stadiums are like way bigger too. Yeah, so it was, like you, you didn't, you didn't. You didn't show up to the Lions practice like, damn, that's Amon Ross St. Brown. Like, whoa. Yeah, yeah like, you, you, you did you know anyone on the team? Like, how'd that work? Like, you were shocked that that's, like, that's Amon Ross. Like, damn. No, I, I knew, I knew, I knew he was. Oh. Uh, yeah, I knew. I was, I was no, really like, I knew Jay Mo, obviously. BB was there. So, it was like. And then, like, I didn't really watch the Lions like that. So, it was like, I didn't really know, you know, anybody on the team for real. But I knew, right. I knew you, though. Yeah, no, the, the game's probably didn't air where you were at. No, I don't oh. think so. I think he just didn't watch. He just wasn't watching. Oh, yeah, I didn't uh, even watch NFL like that, bro. Yeah, yeah, I think that's yeah, really yeah, what happened. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Because yeah, I, like I mean, makes sense. Makes sense. The Bear, like, if could you name some players in the Bears, Jimmy? If you had to, like, not really. Besides Justin, Justin Fields, yeah, like. I played in my high school. So this fall or whenever you'd like, you could uh, learn a new language with Babbel. Why Babbel? Because it works. Um, I speak German and English. I used to speak French, and I'm using Babbel to, you know refresh my French so I could, you know, start speaking it again. I'm also going to use Babbel to learn Spanish because, you know, why not know more languages? It's a skill. It's an asset in life. Um, and not a lot of people speak a lot of languages. So um, I think it's really important for a lot of people to learn languages. And Babbel is a great platform to use that. Um, be used by 150 experts uh, to make like 10-minute lessons easy for you. So it's not too long. It's easy to digest and retain the information. Um, it's what I use. So... Um, if it works for me, it can work for you. Why not? And, um, you know, you're going to spend loads of money on tutors to come to your house um, or, you know, worry about playing weird games. You know, those don't really work. So you should go to Babbel and, uh, you know, learn a new language today. With over 10 million subscriptions sold, Babbel is a real language learning tool for real conversations. 
Um, here's a special limited time deal for our listeners to get this started right now. Get 55% off your Babbel subscription, but only for our listeners at babbel.com slash brown bros. Get 55% off babbel.com slash brown bros, spelled B-A-B-B-E-L dot com slash brown bros. Rules and restrictions may apply. Um, who would you try to emulate your game after? <laughs> like, who's your biggest inspiration while playing? Uh, like I said, probably like Barry, LaShawn, and like Jamal, and CJ. Mm-hmm. Then like route running or something, probably like Christian McCaffrey or AK. So I try to be like okay. in that in that area. That's cool. Um, what was your first time like meeting Amon? Like, what was it like? Like, was he a dickhead? Like, was he nice? <laughs> no, he <laughs> texted me. Um, shit, after I got yeah, caught, yeah, I reached out. He reached out. He texted you. Yeah, W teammate. Mm-hmm. Okay, what do you say? The W W teammate. What do you say? He said, he said things like. What's up? It's Amon Ra. Great to have you on the team or something like that. Something yeah, like, like that. congrats. Yeah. Uh, can't wait to get to work. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, a lot of W. You know? I think Jared reached out and j So. Okay. What was it like meeting Demo for the first time? Because we had him on the podcast. Demo? You know, I know him. Yeah. Uh, how was it? I think it was cool. Like, we were just, I think uh, I came out. I think they were doing like OTAs. Oh, yeah, I was on OTAs at that point, at the beginning. So like, y'all were mm-hmm. running and stuff and like doing little drills. So I was just sitting there watching. So it was just like, oh, what's up? I'm Ja, Demo. Boom, I just met all the running backs. And then like they just got back to like doing their drills. So it was like, it wasn't too much talking at that point. But like after that, like, you know, we've been cool ever since though. You call yourself Ja? Huh? You call yourself Ja? Yeah. Jameer. Um, Bro, what's wrong with you? Like <laughs> Jameer. <laughs> I, Nimi, I, I have a question for both of you. What's his face? Demo was at, like, we had a walkthrough. Demo came up to me. He's like, hey, bro, am I sensitive? What do you guys think? Is he sensitive or no? He's a uh, fake sensitive. And Demo, if you're watching yeah, this, is- yeah, we're talking about you on our podcast. He's I a like, fake I, sensitive, bro. He's fake, right? Yeah, like, yes, he acts like he's sensitive, serious, but he's actually not. He won't be serious. Yeah. Bro. But Craig? Yeah. yeah. Craig is dead. Craig oh, yeah, Craig. Craig, Craig oh yeah. God. He's a fake sensitive, and Craig's a real sensitive. He's yeah, trying to act like bro. he's not, but he's... Yeah, yeah like, anything, he's, anything you say, he will try to see if, like, you're shooting on him. Like, it's like, like bro, what? You who hurts you? Who hurts you? you, you know? like, he's, like, staring at you like this, and I'm like... Yeah, like, trying to figure out, like... <laughs> <laughs> like, damn, like, who hurt him? Like, someone broke his heart. Man. Fuck. What, you got bullied in high school? I don't know. Um, what's your relationship like with Dima? You guys are good friends? You guys are pals? Yeah, yeah that's not my big brother, yeah. bro. Okay. Yeah, yeah, anytime anytime I need something like you know, he's there, I have a question to ask. Oh, like like what? Oh, like question? You said what? Nothing. Wait, I wanna I wanna ask about Spider Man. I know my brother loves movies. I see the Marvel in the back in the background of your room. Yeah, what's that? Um What's what? Oh that's so, wh- where's your where's your can love you, for Spider Man? Can you move from? over your can you move your big head real quick? That's crazy. Oh, okay. Hmm. You said what? Where's your love for, for Spider Man come from? Uh, I think it's like the first superhero movie I watched. Like with Tobey like, Maguire. Like you love him, love him. Like you like you're him for Halloween. Yeah, like, shit. You're like, no, like, like before, like I didn't even really know Jameer. He wanted to go watch Spider Man. What was the movie that came out in me? Oh, because just came out the Spider Verse one. Yeah, yeah. He was like he yeah. was so locked in. I fell asleep. Like that. I didn't. <laughs> it was regular. Like, do you like Spider Man shit in your in your house? You said what? You like Spider Man shit in your crib? Like no. No, like I how obsessed are you? No, I, I got that, and I have like a what I got, like another poster or some shit like that. But I think that's about it. They need Spider Man probably every year for for not Christmas, Halloween. I was asking. No, Spider Man. No, I was when I was younger. When I was like five. When I was like five through like nine. Like, <laughs> every every year. Every year, bro. I used to work with Tool, <laughs> like Tool guy. When I was five. Have it like have it under my clothes. When I hear <laughs> somebody somebody get in trouble, like at uh, recess, somebody fall, rip that bitch open. <laughs> <laughs> you stupid. Uh, who, who, who's your favorite Marvel character in me? Like in the movies, I'd say Iron Man. But like overall, like non movies. What do you mean non movies? What are you going off of? It's like video games or like just comics. movies. You don't comics. read comics. I I just know superheroes. Don't stuff. exactly. You I don't read know. comics. But I, I know. But I know. You said like, besides movies, like you're going like, off movies, shows, TV shows, like that's what I'm talking about. Like digital okay. screen. 
No, it could be like comics and shit. Like, you don't read comics. I've read some comics before. Let me see. Like, because, like, for example, I would say Hulk is dope, but, like, the movies fucked him up. But obviously the Hulk is, like, a fucking, you know. Yeah. What'd the movies do? You just see him? Like, he's fucking a nerd. Like, he's pussy. Like, yeah, he's, it's like, he's, he's soft. Like, dirty. yeah, they did him bad. Did you not watch it? Yeah, they did him dirty. They did him whole. Anyway. I, I, don't, I don't watch movies. Okay. Um, yeah, I would say Black Panther. Like Bro, you're talking. just saying that. Like, like, no, nah, Black Panther. Because he's black. <laughs> that's not why no, I'm saying that. Say someone else. Like, I've never that's not why I'm saying that. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've never heard that. that. Yeah, somebody's favorite. Yeah. He's just um, saying that because Wakanda forever. Like, bro. No, I'm saying he's tough. Like, even before he was in the movies, like, I had a com- That's the first comic I ever bought was Black Panther versus the um, uh, Fantastic Four. First comic I ever bought. So, yeah. But other than him, I'd say Silver Surfer is tough. Yeah, he is tough. Or. Thor. Is the. Uh, what is it? Fantastic Four? Is that Marvel? Yeah. yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. Cool. What's what's it? Quicksilver? Is that is that a superhero? Yeah. Yeah. Marvel. Yeah. Damn. There's so many. I feel like there is a lot. What's his vision? Is OD? Just like his. Okay. Now, I'm not saying he's like he's cool, but his powers. You're, are just you're only saying that because Papa loves him. No, they're actually cheating. I, he's in the when he's in the movie, he was OD. <laughs> like he's yeah. cheating. That, that's that's my dad. Vision's my dad's favorite superhero. So like my brother. He's, he's, he cheating. looks he's ugly. Like, like oh, but I'm saying his powers him. are crazy. He definitely got nerfed. Oh yeah, his powers are crazy. Me, he said he got nerfed. Don't me. He did. He did. He did, yeah. His, he should be unbeatable, really. Is that it? Well, shoot. I think that's it. Um, I appreciate you, Jameer. Of course. Um, you know, showing up to the podcast. I know we had some technical difficulties with your iPad or whatever you had going on, but you made it, so thank you. Mm-hmm. Um, you guys can catch us. Uh, on YouTube, wherever you guys, you know, watch the St. Brown podcast, make sure you guys tune in. Um, we'll have another guest, hopefully next week. I'm not sure. Um, I know you guys said you want, you know, Panay and his brother, Hutchinson, J-Mo, we might get J-Mo. We should have had J-Mo a few weeks ago, but he, um, something happened with him. So you guys can tell him, you know, thank you a lot, but appreciate you, Jameer. Uh, we'll see EQ. We'll see you on Sunday. Um, make sure you bring your, your, your track cleats because I'm ready. No, I need track cleats. I can wear regular cleats. Barefoot. Oh, you? Yeah, I was running barefoot.